Good morning from the Rancho. It is January 13th, 2018. Uh, nice to see all of you today. Last night I had the pleasure of making the Coats 9500, our good friend Gerald. The cream cheese cinnamon buns that he's always raving about. And uh, he, we were on a hangout last week, and uh, we really like Gerald. He's uh, he's, he's yes, sweet. Yes, and we, we know him from a long Charlie, time. We like him a lot. I mean, he's definitely, definitely a favorite here of ours. I'm just getting things adjusted. Pardon me. That's why my eyes are all over the place. Hi, Kevin, Kevin Chambers, how are you, my friend? Good to see you. Good to see you. One of my Good favorite, favorite people on, uh, on YouTube there. Awesome yeah, to see you. I just responded to your comment. Thank you for your beautiful comment. On yeah, the, awesome uh, sauce. Track no video. Yeah. Hi, Annie. Nice to Hi, see Annie. you. Good evening in uh, New Zealand there. I hope you're doing well. God knows what time it is down there. It's got to be like what? I don't even know. It's probably Sunday morning or it's, something. It's uh, in the morning. We got, what time is it now here? It is 11.11. .11. So they have three in the morning. Three in the morning, Sunday. Hey, do you ever sleep? Hi, Drew. Nice to see you. Hello, Drew. What if Annie ever, if Annie ever sleeps? Yeah, I've got it figured out now. I, I can... <laughs> All right. Yes, yes. What well, am I, Vegas yes, fixing? Yeah. Chop liver. Okay. Hi, Rory. Oh, it's eight eleven. Nice to see you, Rory. So, well, you know, yeah. our friend Gerald, we like uh, we like Gerald a lot, and it was nice to uh, bikini up last night and be in the uh, kitchen. But more importantly, um, they turned out good. We're giving them a try. Hi, Sister Earth. Hi, nice Sister. to see you. Hi, Diane. Hi, Diane. Always Diane. a pleasure see you okay it's morning there it's sunday morning yeah it's three in the morning no right. it's eight it's eight eleven in the morning yeah, eight a.m just a little 8 a.m oh sunday morning. bloody hell me calculations are off <laughs> <laughs> yeah i'm mean, not gonna i'm gonna keep my mouth shut on big that. kiss big to, you, to you guys a lot of fun last night it was a good you know, there's been so much stuff going on. Uh, thank you, Diane. I hope you enjoyed that uh, video. There was so much, been so much stuff going on in the uh, uh, community and stuff that uh, once in a while, just to get pull away from that. And of course, things are going to get much worse before they get better in that regard. But it doesn't mean that we can't. Leopard <laughs> blue. Megan's fiction just saved herself there. <laughs> but it doesn't mean that we can't have fun on YouTube and pull away from that. I've had a lot of people that say, yeah. "Hey, I'm enjoying, mm -hmm. I'm enjoying all the drama and all the uh, action that's unfolding in the communities." But it's nice to pull away from it, or else you just get it's it's too much of an overload of stuff going on uh, right now. And uh, yeah, it's eleven twelve. Hey, Vegas fiction. It's 11, 12 here too, baby. So I don't know whether you're just waking up or you haven't gone to sleep. Ricky Rooney, nice to see Ricky. you. Hey. What's going just on? Just seen your amazing comment on the other video. Thank <laughs> you so much. A big kiss to you, Ricky. Yeah, it's really nice to uh, caught the live drop. And hey, Mark Young, nice to see you. I've always enjoyed uh, Larry David's creativity. And although I don't subscribe, I don't really watch much TV, I really feel like uh, Raise Your Enthusiasm, especially the stuff from years ago, is really the most outstanding comedy. Uh, far and away better than Seinfeld, I think, in terms of uh, people. Oh, yeah. You can't watch That's Curb Your Enthusiasm without... Uh, hey, Mike G., nice to see you, Hi, my Mike. friend. Without really digging... Um, Susie Green, especially the housewife that you know from New York, screams at Jeff all the time. You, you sit fucking all these yeah, kind of all like... <laughs> You know, you, you just got to love it. You're using know? some foul language, and, but uh, it is really funny. Yeah, well, yeah, it still, it gets, funny. It still gets a rating for it's all. A, it's a good laugh. Yeah. It's, a, it's yeah. a good laugh. <laughs> and uh, who's the guy that you like? Because it's in a good context. 
Yeah, because I'm I'm always like a, I'm always I always love the the Jewish humor, and one of my regrets is um you know I'd love to be able to spend time in that mm. kind of environment with that where uh, everybody's so animated, you know, and everything's always like nine out of ten on the drama scale. <laughs> Hi, Dorothy. Nice to see Hi, you. Yeah. yeah, you better get some sleep. Vegas fixing out there driving the streets. Yeah, of, uh, Vegas. Being, I hope uh, everything is okay in Vegas. I saw that one video where you said you had that. Yeah, there was a eerie Kamaka. passenger. That yeah. eerie passenger. Just to give you a look for those of you who specifically came, this is the way the uh, mm -hmm. this is the way the buns look here this morning. They're big. They're called truck stop mm -hmm. size. Uh, buns here, and I think that they really turned out uh, really turned out nicely here. So I'm, they're they open up very nicely here. You can see that they have a ton of uh, a ton of cinnamon in them, and that turned out really good. So I'm going to go ahead and take a bite of one. Hmm. Well, wow. Andrea Hi, Wheatley, nice Andrea, to see you. Nice yeah. to see you. How are you doing? Oh, wow. That is just unbelievable to, to taste you. that. Missy Jen, go ahead and try a bite of that. It is incredible. Uh, finally, I've been waiting. I'll tell you, that is amazing. I was lying awake in bed all night waiting. Mark Young, that's what we were making last night. But, um, yeah, a lot of fun on there. Had a few beers. Just cut loose. It's been so intense. I put up a video this morning on the Rosie O'Kelly channel just to kind of lighten the mood a little bit because things are going to get a lot more. Uh, things are going to get a lot more intense, I think, over the next week or so. So it look good. Thank you, Mark. Yeah. I'm doing nice. good, I've been Andrea. doing that. It's not like I just started doing that bikini baking. I've been doing that stuff what, Jen, for years in there on the evenings, mm -hmm. making things because I love to bake. How's that taste? Mm -hmm. Delicious. You like yeah. that cream cheese icing on top of that? That's what Gerald specifically specked in on that. Really nice and soft. Yeah, we had a lot of fun. If you haven't seen the hangout last night, mm -hmm. it really is. We do have a lot of laughs. We talked about the uh, the very sketchy and shady Mister X, and kind of filled in some of his uh, character. Mm -hmm. the and we also have, mm -hmm. thank you, Mark. We also had, uh, you know, filled in a lot of stuff in the background. If you haven't mm -hmm. seen, I've had so many people ask me, "How did you and Elvis ever?" Uh, uh, link up on YouTube and stuff, and the history that we have is extremely long. By YouTube standards, it's it's a lifetime almost, you know, of uh, knowing uh, knowing each other and stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, thank you, Ricky. And if you look at a playlist, I have a lot of playlists for every trip that we ever went on, every trip uh, all the way back to 2013. Um, back there when we went to see Joan Rivers in Reno, but one of them is called one of the playlists is called Elvis's Redemption Road, and it was the first time that I tried to have an intervention <laughs> with, <laughs> with Elvis, and I'll just leave it at that. It's a 15 part series. You can see Mr. X in there, how shady he is, and mm. uh, you know, Jen, right? This guy's really X Mr. X, right? Is and that. Then, yeah, you can't be cream cheese icing. He's it's really rat. great. So yeah, he's he's just he's sketchy, right? Because going he's on an Alaska cruise. Going on an Alaska cruise in January. And I had our research and development team say there's no cruises going up to Alaska except the gay they have some gay guys cruise or something. Yeah, some up gay there. cruise. You know, it's some hoity hoity toity how to make flambe and all yeah. this uh hors d'oeuvres and all these little things for hoity-toity events that uh, you in the stage. They played oh, yeah, we saw Joan. We were probably the last players. people to see her before she uh, she died. We, we called it the uh, uh, we called it Joan Rivers End of Life Tour. Little did we know that she would be dead soon after. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah, it was funny, Vegas Fixer went, 
when I landed in Chicago, and I did an afternoon shoot, an afternoon upload from Chicago. The only one that knew I was going to Chicago was Missy Jen. You know, I just uh, I snuck off. I had I had some I had one other thing to do. I don't care whether anybody believes it or not. But uh, I started filming in like in the usual afternoon walk I take around, and I turned around, and all of a sudden, Elisa Marie was <laughs> behind me. And my phone just started blowing up with people. You must have lost your mind <laughs> to be out in Chicago and trying to get involved in that in that mess out there. But it was a it was a fun trip. Yeah, he doesn't he doesn't cook a lot on his channel. Yeah, yeah, he was he was uh, yeah slimmer. So. Mm. These are good, aren't they? These are awesome. Mm. They really turned out nice. The bread, not too sweet, overpowering, which is the sweet. I like that. Usually, when you go and buy them, they're like really sugary, sweet. These are not sweet. Yeah. Kevin, they really turned out good. Really nice. Really turned out good. So, um, mm. really good. Anybody has any suggestions for next Friday? Just put them in the description box after the event here, and that'll be good. So what's going on with you guys? We're going to have the uh, – the Lisa Marie never smelled bad when I was there. I can't attest to now. That was in uh, 2015. So I can't tell you now. <laughs> there we go. Hey, Linda Francine, did you enjoy that video over there this morning, huh? Over there. <laughs> <laughs> Linda Francine likes good comedy over there. Over there. Yeah, Kevin, I wish uh, I wish we could uh, send some of these to you. Plenty yeah, of cinnamon. Nice. Yeah, they're really good. They really turned out great. So we'll be on 5 p.m. tonight on this channel which will be 8 o'clock on the East Coast. And you can join us then. Oh, I feel great today. Yeah, I got to just go out and do so. I'm going to enjoy it. Nice to see you, Violet Vixen. I want to go outside today and uh, do some yard work and get some exercise. Yeah, I thought everybody would get a kick out of that uh, video over there, the uh, Shawarma Summit here. Wow, Scott. Wow. Look at that. Minus seven. Learn to love it, guys. Minus seven. Can you imagine that? I'll be right back. <clears throat> and we cannot complain with the, uh, what do we have here? 50 outside? Yeah, that's that is true, Violet. I am going to be on at six PM our time, which is uh Let's see, six, six, I'll be on 6 p.m. Pacific time, so that will be uh, 9 p.m. Eastern, Eastern time. Oh, boy. So, uh, yeah, minus, on, minus seven is crazy. I'll be on my own computer. I'll be on panel with my own computer, Andrea. I'm a big nomadic fanatic, and I expect these very relieved marshals getting all the trolls' attention. Well, well, all I can say is people look in and they see there's a long history and things, and a lot of people are like, now, where in the hell did you come from? But uh, in, I'm not a new cowgirl on the scene. Yeah, what's the real rancher look like? 
I love that. You like that? We put a pig on. We had some mud wrestling back there for DW, some big rigs rolling through. Mm -hmm. All right, well, we'll be seeing you tonight then, Andrea. Yeah, Andrea, you take care, baby doll. We'll see you tonight. But, uh, yeah, it's a lot of fun. The thing that bugged me last night, <clears throat> well, of course, I'm, I'm not saying – You know, he's perfect, but some stuff like last night, this shift column on the Lisa Marie Lisa starting Marie, out to drop. Yes. It's a shift, it's a tube that goes down and it, the linkage, broken linkage goes bad. But you can't tell the guy because he puts up the video, the Lisa Marie is broke down, and the comments are disabled. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking to myself, what the, you know, you want to tell the guy, here's the, here's the deal, right? And you can't say a word. <laughs> I mean, oh, it's definitely a, it's definitely a simple linkage uh, issue down there. It could be uh, something as simple as binding or something like that. Uh yeah, four-year-old <laughs> cougar, bad stuff. So, you know, it gets kind of crazy. Okay, Andrea, we'll see you in a bit. I, I, I understand you. I feel the same way. <laughs> yeah. He may need a new steering column. He may. I would pull it out because I have a uh, 80, I had an 88 Coachman camper van, little rascal. And I um, I ended up having to switch out the steering column. It's a real weak link on those rigs. The uh, starter key gets all bound up, and you have to almost take a channel lock to oh, turn yeah. the thing. I just took the son of a gun. Oh, yeah. Yeah, just pull it out. WD-40. It's more than that, Scott. I'll tell you that. There's some binding problem there. And the ball joints are kind of gone bad. <laughs> in there uh, you know if it has the ball it's just the suspension is is uh these i've told jen before this is too much weight on these uh oh, there's I mean, too it's much old. weight on i these. mean it all lasts them so long yeah i just think these camper vans are just uh you know i had a 74 gmc motorhome and that was eleven thousand pounds these, these things are 8800 pounds i mean and they're 19 feet long so Stop worrying about. Oh, it's all good. I don't know that but that old Mercury was a problem. Yeah, I wish people would stop worrying about these other channel names. Turn Rosie and Miss Jen, they're awesome hangout and video. Yeah, it's all, uh, Kevin. The reality is things will probably never be the same again, especially since we're going to Florida and everything. Yeah, there's a YouTube video on how to fix everything. Exactly correct. That's exactly correct. Vegas fiction. Everything out there. Except how to how to fix our personal problems <laughs> here on uh, YouTube. I'm gonna wait for the feedback when DW Red sees that video. <laughs> of course, Ricky. Yeah, I've already had a. There's a parody which called Rosie O'Kelly Time Traveler at the Alamo today, and it's got me with a, a long rifle on top of you know under siege, getting ready to go down there. It's funny. That is really funny. I'm going to go grab a uh, cup of coffee. I'll be right back. Yeah. No worries, Ricky. It's all good. <clears throat> Much appreciated support, Ricky. <clears throat> so the fireplace is over there, and it's looking pretty. Yeah, and it's cold outside today. I went out. And uh, fed, I took George out and fed George. And... Uh, it was cold this morning. Whew.
Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mark. Well, yeah. It's all in the time travel, babies. It's all in time travel. You just kind of travel back and forth and uh, <laughs> well, Ricky, you gotta, you gotta take pride for who you are. I mean, take a stand. You take a stand in life for yourself, and be proud of yourself, and move on forward in life and just you know people that don't like you just you know you shove them out of the way and uh, people that love you you'll embrace and then you just move on hi maxine how are yeah. you doing the really sad thing is that uh you put up satire or something like that and there's some there's some dumbbells out there that think it's real, like there's really going to be a shawarma summit or something like that, and they're going crazy over in the comments section on the thing. I mean, just a bunch of, just some idiots over there. Clean the whole mess up, stand back. So I don't, I, uh, I enjoy the interaction with uh, people. It's funny. I'm gonna get me a cup of coffee too. And then when they say, "Oh, you just came on the scene," I'm like, uh, "Refer back to 2015. I've been here a long time on this shit wagon." <laughs> now, the good thing about last night too is that, um, and I've turned off the uh, super chat. But I'm not saying I'll never turn it on again or have an alternate way if someday we want to have a little bit, if you want to express your gratitude. But for fundraising and stuff like that, and for for now, we're going to be using the uh, Hangouts to raise money for charity. And last night, I'm really happy to say, as a result of the uh, teeny weeny bikini baking and the Coach 9500 iced uh, cream cheese, cinnamon buns. I'm happy to say that uh, over $1,100 was raised for St. Jude's Hospital Children's Cancer Center, which is a really, really nice thing. Nice to see you, Maxine. And, uh, and I think we can all agree that that's, the, that's a noble cause. And it's not one that we have to think twice about uh, feeling guilty about that because that's a lot of money to raise in uh in one night and that's really because of the efforts of cooper cooper who himself donated uh one thousand dollars last night to that uh to that cause so tonight when we do the hangout you'll see a link in tonight's hangout when we begin for the wounded warriors project thank you uh thank you jake just something that missy jen and i've talked over for a while here mm -hmm. and uh, to direct funds and to stop, uh, to lessen all this uh, e-bagging and all this stuff. That's cool. Vegas Six and said, my dad loyally donates his St. Jude's every month, each month. I'm going to set myself up on an automatic uh, donor thing too. So I really feel like this is, uh, if you really don't need the money, and I'm not, I'm not going to enable a lifestyle where people don't want to. Uh, well, they'll be able to see it's a direct link, Mark Young. I Nothing passes through Jen and my hands. It's a direct link last night to St. Joseph's, uh, to uh, the uh, St. Jude's Hospital Children Cancer yeah. Center. Tonight is a direct link to Wounded Warrior Project. So there's no, there's mm -hmm. no second guessing about uh, where the money goes. That goes straight to you know, them. Yeah, I would not... Uh, you know, I, I would not be comfortable in that situation doing that, so I don't have to worry about it. Okay, Ricky, thank you. Got to go play park manager. There we go. Nice to see you, Ricky. So we're going to be doing that from now on. So at various times through tonight's hangout, I'll ask people to, uh, if they have a, uh, thank you, sister, if they have a mind to, to just hit the link and even give $5.
Okay, take care, Kevin Chambers. Thanks for stopping by and saying hi. Uh, we really love to see you here. You're see you tonight. You're really you and Sister Earth, Vegas Fixin, really long-standing supporters of the uh, channel and uh, stuff. And I really appreciate you guys uh, being here. <clears throat> so that'll be a good thing because uh, we don't ever do enough for our vets, in my opinion, especially the ones that are wounded. They not only do they have the physical trauma, Missy Jen, of missing limbs and uh, terrible wounds and stuff, but they've got to mentally cope with the fact that there's things that they'll never do again. Right. And it's really very difficult to, you know, to imagine what some of these people have been through and then to be in a time of incredible need and then not have the resources and things there beyond what the uh, VA gives. It's very heartbreaking. So we're looking uh, looking forward to doing that tonight. So what do you think of these babies? Mm, uh, Doubled up on them, huh? Mm, yeah, I have to have another one. That's good. And he said, I saw an executive order was signed to help vets just this week. That is really great. That's what you like to hear. That's exactly what you want to hear. But it's, uh, it, it's oftentimes very heartbreaking mm -hmm. and disappointing. So. Oh, these buns are, uh, Jen doubled up on them, so they must be pretty good, huh? These these buns are awesome. They're like <clears throat> nice and soft. The icing is really creamy. They're fall apart tender. Not too sweet. And the cinnamon is not too overpowering. It's really nice, really, really nice. <clears throat> Can you guys imagine it's like minus seven degrees in Iowa? Imagine that, Missy Jen, minus seven. I mean, it's not the kind of weather you want a bikini up for a photo shoot on top of DW Red's uh, Peterbilt, right? Up there. <laughs> I'm frozen. Looks like a sugar high, Jake said. Yes, 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 a sugar high. Actually, those They're are not very, not, sweet. Not very sweet at all. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a very light touch when I make uh, sweet goods. What do you think, Sister Earth? Huh? I don't like things that are too things that are too sweet tend to start to lose I usually their don't flavor. Eat, I don't eat uh, cinnamon buns from the store because the the icing is on there. It's just pure sugar. Sugar. Yeah, this was a cream cheese. And, and then it drives your sugar up, and then your sugar drops, and then you got sugar problems. Exactly. And, I mean, it just it spikes up and down and all that stuff. So this is and, just. Uh, uh, that's why I usually yeah. don't eat them. So. It's like Sister Earth uh, said, she's not a big sweet person uh, either. And I really appreciated your comment uh, that you left yesterday, Sister Earth, vis-a-vis. <laughs> Letting someone have the freedom to be themselves on YouTube. And if they violate the YouTube YouTube terms of service, then let YouTube take them out as opposed to, you know, let's let's make someone face the financial music, but let's make sure that we don't remove their chance of maybe I was uh, in Germany in the maybe 80s, getting yes. back on track. Cheesecake and a foodie book. There we go, Vegas fixing. <laughs> I was going to school till 86. I graduated in 86 and started working in 86. Yeah, that was it, Sister Earth. I just believe in the natural action of YouTube, the terms, and I just, I like the people involved. Almost to a person, it's funny. People see us. People see us communicating in live streams, and they're like, "Oh, I thought you guys hated each other." No, we don't hate each other. We just have a little disagreement on certain points of uh, certain points of things. That's all. Yeah, hate is a pretty strong. Word. Yeah, let YouTube take them out. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, it's, it's like Linda said. I won't sit and watch channels just so I can turn them in. Turn them in. That's a ridiculous way to uh, live. It really is. Yeah, the king has a fatwa. <laughs> <laughs> T Burns is like, is that is that he's uh, he's comments on the video this morning. Are you is that guy on the right, uh, dude? <laughs> oh, that's my laugh. Never mind. <laughs> Elvis, we're gonna do up Robin if a second transfer law. And he thinks he can cheat the change. He's there's no escaping the charge backstop. I mean, it's ridiculous. There ain't no way. It's, Hi, Josh. You know, good luck. Hi, Joshy. Good morning to you, sweetheart. There's uh. You know, these, these guys aren't dummies that did this thing, okay? The chargebacks will occur, but hopefully he can keep his, uh, his channel. You know, that's all I cared about. So he has a chance to restructure if he so chooses. Okay, he's waiting for PayPal to verify his new bank again. Just pissed me off last night. He's got that video about the trucks broke down and the comments were turned off. And that, you know. Gosh. Thank you, T. Bergs. Very nice to see you, uh, too. I tell you, T. Bergs says, I just recently discovered you. And, of course, we have Jen and Rosie Reality TV, which Missy Jen maybe mainly runs in the Rosie O'Kelly channel. It's really three channels that we run. And Jen has a Farm Girl Marie uh, channel that she does some stuff. And she, her passion is tractors, farm equipment. And uh, she's also our drone flyer. Uh, here and tomorrow, we're going to go ahead and get some more drone footage. <clears throat> well, I think it'll be rather spectacular. When we get that uh, done, yeah. but yeah, it's a big variety channel, and there's a lot of stuff on there. There's moonshine, there's guns, there's vintage audio. You can see all the stuff behind me. Uh, there's travel videos, there's baking videos. It's a huge variety channel, and something for everybody. <clears throat> and the Rosie Murphy channel. This one tends to be how to how to un, how to remove stuck galvanized pipes. How to how to set in a single mixer shower valve and and those kind of things. So, well, if he disconnected his ad sets before they put the money in, there's no problem. No, the 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 ad sets was fully connected when the money uh, before the money went in. So. Hmm. Um, no, I don't think so this year, mm -hmm. Linda. Well, it's hard to say because of the buyers. I'm not going to be retired, so, um, yeah. He opens new accounts to hide what he has now. I'm not sure if he opened that. I think he opened that so he wouldn't be shut out of banking altogether in case this stuff hit the fan. <clears throat> well, you milk the views, but it's not like uh, it's not like for me, T. Bergs. I haven't been involved every step of the way for years, so it's not late to the uh, late to the party by any means on my part. Shoot, I haven't really followed the <sighs> whole gestalt of him. <clears throat> I watched here and there a video. Over the last year, you know, view count, uh, view counts. Uh, I, I never paid attention to view counts of other people. Well, what is what is YouTube about? View, view counts. <clears throat> I when I watch somebody's video, I watch it because I want to see what they what their message is in their video. And you can't tell people not to watch up. I put a video out yesterday telling people to un uh, to unsubscribe the channel because you're probably not going to like what's coming up in the future if you you know things change and they change course so oh debbie lynn this is how they were <laughs> hi spirit of salt nice to see you you'll have to rewind and think, Wait, I love you baby doll 
Yeah, love our Debbie true. Lynn. They really turned out great, Debbie Lynn, and we really wow. appreciated you being along last night. It was awesome to have you on, uh, as usual, <clears throat> one of our favorite gals on uh, YouTube and in life. And we'll yeah. be seeing Debbie Lynn in late February. And that'll be a lot of fun, Debbie Lynn, to hang out. Sound like these movies sound like that's for us to get quick be a begging. I'm not sure, T Berg. It's a simple problem of linkage, but last night he had the uh, description, he had the comments turned off. So, how was I supposed to tell? <laughs> Hi, Lisa. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> uh, you have hey, to rewatch. Hi, Chess. Good for you. Nice to see you, baby doll. And it's like, uh, yeah, you, you know, missed it. My thing's broke ah. down, and I'm going to turn off the comment section so nobody can give advice. I'm like, I oh, ate yeah. two of those delicious <laughs> uh, cinnamon buns. Mm, they were good. Delicious. Hey, James. How are you? Yeah. So I'm gonna, you know, for me, I'm at the point I'm not gonna apologize for uh, because I'm in the middle of it because I've been in the, I've been in the crap for years, so it's nothing new to me. You know, there's parody videos of me already out there on the on the top of the Alamo and stuff with a long rifle in my hand. So uh, I just say I want world peace. World peace. So, uh, it's like web. when they ask. Uh, and y'all, if you want a really <laughs> premier, high production value cooking channel, I encourage you to sub up to Test Cooks for you because her cooking videos have extremely high production values with recipes down below, links to cookware. It's a very, what I call a very, uh, it has a lot of vertical integration in it, the channel. Uh, let's see. I don't know. It seems fishy to me. Lisa Marie conveniently breaks down when he's at the lowest point. The thing that you don't understand, T. Bergs, and the things that people don't understand is <clears throat> plain and simple. Elvis just does not lie. He just has no filter on him. He just will absolutely, positively. I mean, he mucks it up at the uh, Everglades, you know, with that BS about the generator. But the generator had a problem at that particular right. at that particular time. But the guy absolutely has no filter on uh, has no filter on him. There's no there's no guile in the in it. There's just no governor and no filter. So I'm <laughs> quite sure that that linkage has a problem because I had to change yeah. out the one on the eighty eight coachman. The first thing I did before I could even get the thing get the damn it thing to the uh, smog smog shop so oh, the, the things are pieces of crap the uh linkage yeah i yeah, remember it's, i say jk no cow good morning to you it the handsomest guy in the building it's just a plastic piece in the column it's a linkage I thing just, in the uh in the column that's all there's a binding in there that, that probably something kind of mm -hmm. slipped down in there and is causing it to bind so Oh, he needs to be a ham and egger like me too, T. Bergs. I'm supposed to be retired June 30th of last year. I'm still going strong and I'm now committed through all of 2018. Yeah, I get pissed off. I'd like to be out at the RTR, you know, crapping in a bucket. Or doing <clears> Everybody's whatever. ill over there. I'm glad I'm not there. I have no immune system. <sighs> yeah, everybody's sick over there. I wouldn't like, want to be there. Yeah, so that's kind of the way I feel like. Uh, I feel One like gave that. the other a hug and a kiss, and then the next person was ill, and it, it just spread like a wildfire. And T-Berg, maybe you agree with me that uh, when you're out there, and if you choose that lifestyle, like I said, our our form of government allows you to have that pursuit of happiness, but it also means that you have to suffer the consequences of your decision-making. So I support the right of him not to be a ham and egger, but I do resent the eventual support that will have to be given to people that don't choose to work and pay into the system. That's what I don't think. I'm not sure spirit of salt. I guess I could put him here on the rancho uh, weeding and doing garden work. He could be the uh, he could be our gardener here, I guess. 
We'll have to put fertilizer in the weeds. <laughs> I think it was an evening. It always takes the cake, yeah. I'm not sure. I just, uh, I don't know. You know, uh, to me, honest to goodness, I haven't watched Nomadic. I got nothing against the guy. I haven't watched his channel in two years. I just, I don't get a lot of content out of it. You know, I just, I, <clears throat> I think this community is 10 times, is this community is 100 times more colorful and 100 times more watchable than that stuff. Uh, it goes on. Yeah, back down search would be tough for a conventional job now. Yeah, it probably would. So, I mean, that's, that's the realities of that. I just, uh, they, there's no appeal to that for me. I like, I just think they're boring. I don't get anything out of them. I like to I like to be places where I don't want to say weird people, but just you know culturally different and uh, spiritually different people. Uh, where Vegas Fixin says, "Oh God, Rosie, how do you think that would work out if Elvis is your gardener?" Well, I'd have a shitload of weeds and uh, nothing would grow. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think, I think his uh, genes are such that there'll be some issues with health. Yeah, they don't care. I mean, if you need a Walmart greeter, any warm body, AWB will do. Yeah. How long can I look at a 40 pound cat, Jax? I just, I don't know. I just, um, Everybody's got their own flavors. Yeah, some people I enjoy just, it. Some people, I don't begrudge anybody anything. It's just not something that I enjoy. I but, enjoy uh, looking at tractors driving across the field. I'm subscribed to a tractor channel um, in the Netherlands, and I watch every day one video about different companies that have tractors and stuff. And so, they yeah. visit, they, they, they visit. Co uh, companies all across the Netherlands and stuff. And every day they stop somewhere and make videos. I, mean, I, I like I like real people that have real individu individuality to them, like Howie Rolls cats. and some other <laughs> band people that are kind of tough guys in a band. I mean, Howie Rolls, this guy works as a itinerary bouncer in clubs, and he's forever getting teeth knocked out <laughs> and stuff. And he lives in his van, and we. You know, I comment on this stuff, and I, I just enjoy it, you know. <clears throat> That's what I kind of like, the color of, uh, I don't like boring, boring communities. I like communities where, uh, where there's a lot of moving pieces on the board, and it's just not endless travel and uh, stuff. It's, it's the human element that, uh, that really governs and interaction. When you meet new, new UT people, like us, J.K. NoCal, Missy Jen and I had the pleasure of uh, J.K. NoCal, Mrs. J.K. NoCal, to have a really nice lunch, uh, excuse me, nice dinner uh, this uh, <clears throat> this late fall, and we had a great time. I mean, somebody else that uh, you, you'll find out in time who the gang of four is, uh, t Burbs. Uh, right, right now it's got to. Uh, right now we need that sort of uh, communist party of China sort of subterfuge. Now we need that. We need that cloak of. Uh, you know, we need that cloak of anonymity here. But uh, I don't think I'll ever reveal it. But they can reveal it themselves at such time as they choose to. Because I'll tell you guys again for the 50,000th time. Oh, wow. Rumba's closed due to fire. Wow. I didn't think it was that far up the road. Hmm. What? They closed it? I'm not sure spirit of salt. Oh, did, oh, did they have a fire? Oh, the family's home burned down. Wow. Oh, no. So many people have been touched by fires and stuff like that. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not sure T-Berg's about, uh, about that, but uh, make no mistake, there's a common interest in, uh, in seeing things advance towards a more solid footing for the future, not this, not this, uh, not this uh, constant uh, cycle of uh, stuff. Most of those types of jobs, it's really so sad. So what are they going to do now? 
I guess the house comes first. I hope they Are had they gonna... insurance. I'm going to be joining JK No Cal's team when I retire because JK, tell him we got work for life. Work for life here. And I told JK No Cal, anything except finished drywall work. Don't, don't ask me to do finished drywall work. I'd rather pitch myself off of a drywall 30 floor. Really, I hate I've that shit. That I'll do rough in drywall, but no way. I'll pull, I'll pull wiring. I'll do circuit breaker hook downs. I'll do plumbing. I'll do PEX. I'll do anything. I'll do framing. I'll do the work. Venting, HVAC, running, installation of water heaters. There ain't no way in God's green earth I'm ever going to do uh, finished drywall. Walk work, wall work again. I hate that crap. You look at my videos of restoration, I look like a snowflake in there. Yeah, it's good stuff. So, yeah, I'm not sure what happened on Lacey Rock's uh, hangout. I'm not sure what went down over there. I guess it sounds like a lot of people got doxed out and stuff, so I'm not sure. I mean, good thing for Jen and I. Everybody already knows where we live and everything, so it's nothing new. Phone number, not sure. Got no. Yeah, but other have been. Did you secretly bail him, Mr. H? I don't think he's been bailed out. I couldn't even leave a response on his video because he didn't even have the comments uh, section on it. He does not. Mm -hmm. I don't have his phone number, and I told him don't. Uh, I said don't don't tell me your phone number. I don't even want it. He's changed his phone number like fifty times in the last six hours. I don't want your phone number. So. Bye, Darth. Bye, Take care. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I don't like the drywall work. That sucks. <clears throat> you know, I don't want his number. He's going to bail him out. He's probably got a simple linkage problem anyway. He's got people that are are uh, fans in Florida. They'll be more than happy to stop by and uh, take a look at that. Trust me. That <laughs> don't assume it's so all one-sided with... Uh, yeah. Don't assume it's all one-sided with Elvis. There's some definite, absolute, 100% fanboys of that uh, of that channel. So the plot thickens. Yeah, you know, and the out of shape holders. Mm -hmm. Debbie Lee and Elvis has left the building, baby. Elvis has <laughs> left the building. <laughs> so we'll be down there in Florida. Oh. And I'll be uh, I'll be having to sit down with Mr. X. You believe that? And I hope to meet Double D. Yeah. Well, we did T. Bergs. We had him set up for work in Vegas, and he was really <clears throat> interested. Vegas Fixin will tell you. That, yeah, me too, James. Yeah. I can I can I can ha I can hang drywall on a ceiling by myself and have a video showing me with one water one woman drywall hang on the ceiling, but I won't do finish work anymore. He had the 67 comeback. Uh, you know, Vegas Vixen will tell you he was he was very enthusiastic about uh, uh, the idea of yeah. going to Vegas. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Could have parked by uh, Vegas Vixen's office and stuff. Lacey Rocks just went live now. <clears throat> cool. But I don't know what happened. I was doing my own hangout last night, so I don't know what happened on Lacey Rocks' uh, channel. I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, more than that. <laughs> Blow, bloated Elvis last song was the best. He had more heart in it. That was, that's that's right. funny. We're caught in the trap. Do, 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 do. I can't look back ooh, 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 because I love you too much, baby. Do, 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 do. Look at the do. Do, 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 what you do to me, do, 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 he was to the point where he had actually kind of a plan. Yeah, I favor Elvis. That's to, exactly right. To work, to work and and on a strip and do the tribute thing. Yeah, my my favorite is Kentucky Rain. <clears throat> That's my favorite.
Kentucky rain keeps falling down, searching do do with the rain in my shoes, rain in my shoes, searching for you in the cold Kentucky rain. Missy Jen likes the ghetto, and his mama cried on a cold and dark November day. There's another little child is born today in the ghetto, in the ghetto. <laughs> yeah, that's one of my favorites. I'm all shook up. Ho, 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 yeah. I'm in love. I'm all shook up. Ho, 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 ho. That's it. That's right. Yeah, that'd be. Yeah, I've, I know. That's JK, true. you got to put more videos up, man. You just you just tease me with this stuff. You know, you got to put uh, more videos. Your tiny houses on trailers gonna be awesome. Return to send do, 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 do. address unknown. Do, 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 do. No such number. Do, do, do. No such phone. <clears throat> well, I wish I could tell the story about the day Elvis died. My mom had a beauty appointment at a place that was owned and operated by gals from Memphis. Where so <clears throat> don't be cruel. Ooh, too hard to sue. I don't want no other love. Okay, bye. Baby, Diane. if I do, you know the best. Do, 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 do. All right, take care, Diane. Nice to see you, sweetie pie. I'll see you, uh, see you later this evening. You take care. Yeah, good for fire victims. That's exactly right, J. Cal. People need, uh, people need housing around here desperately. Absolutely desperately. Absolutely desperately. I think we'll we'll go about another 15 minutes or so. Uh, okay, little fan fact. Wisdy Houston's mom was one of my sweet inspirations. Oh well. I can't stand but the organized crime boy needs to be stopped. Also the kind of anger makes make her using <clears throat> supper chat will be easy picker super chat <clears throat> yeah after this any content maker using super chat will be easy pickings yeah well you know that's the way it goes there's the boss good morning good afternoon boss good afternoon good day i will be live on this channel at 5 p.m on the west coast 8 p.m on the east coast missy jen will be um camming up at uh, an hour later the first hour on this channel is always dedicated to the side chat. So seeing the women go crazy, huh? That's it. How about Tom Jones? What's new, pussycat? Whoa. What's new, pussycat? Steel studs for less weight. You would be proud if you saw them. I'm proud of you anyway, JK. No, okay, there's not a day that goes by. You're the hardest working tool in the shed, man. By far. J.K. Nocal works his ass off over there. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, this guy's like no no slouch at all. Mama, she, see you later, Annie. You uh, take care. Nice. Yeah, we're going to go about 15 more minutes and then call it. I got a lot of – I want to do some outside work today to get something yeah, accomplished. Out. And the sharpest, too, J.K. Too. My favorite video is uh, – I don't know who in the hell was on uh, – Drury and Kat were on with JK <laughs> <laughs> with, with JK No Cow and JK No Cow <laughs> grabs the link <laughs> and, and he gets right in the middle. You know, when you're seeing it, you see him right in the middle and just stop and he's just like, you know, oh. looking up at the disco lights and stuff. <laughs> uh, um. You take care, Sister Earth. That is really funny there. Okay, you take care, right, Chief Burns. Glory to the ham and eggers, my friend. Glory to the ham right. and eggers. Bye, take care. That's really funny. I'll never forget JK on that video. I mean, I looked at that the morning and I said, man, this is the sharpest tool in the shed right here. <laughs> JK's like, yeah, that's awful. Right. You know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's really bad. <laughs> yeah, take them out and put them on a chain gang. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, you need your big glasses, man. That is some. That is some kind of funny stuff right there. I'll tell you. I just I couldn't believe it. Jen and I were just sitting there cracking up. I said, 
turn down the volume and just watch Jake, you know, turn down Cat's mouth and, and uh, turn on the volume. Just, just watch No Cal on there. And it's like classic No Cal, you know. It's like everybody's on page A and he's on page P on the back, <laughs> page T on the back. Yeah, what I need to do today, Dave Dickey, I need to get out here and cut the grass and get some leaves up, and I need to get something accomplished. Uh, chain gangs build character, that's right. I would take Dave Dickey, I would take Drury Nadab, I would take Elvis, Elvis Camper Van Elvis, and I would take Mr. X. I would chain them all together on a Alabama road in July, and I'd say here's 10 miles of road to tar, boys. Get yourself going to it. Ain't going to be no F the grass, boss. There's a job to be done here. Okay. Hi, Kelly. Nice to see you. <clears throat> Kelly's the one in the, Kelly's in the line of fire now because the big question is, did she or didn't she with Elvis? You know, so, right. Well, she was working hard on the forklift, the, yeah, yesterday I've seen the forklift. Thing. Yeah, we saw the first, first, Look at the boss fuck off, man. <laughs> what a guy. Thank you, boss. That's Corgi. not very nice. Corgi, what are you doing? Are you hobblecock today? Huh? What are you doing? Huh? Stretching out. <clears throat> yeah, it's, uh, poor Nova Gina's got the taint to her now. Hmm? We're cold. What are you doing, Gorgi? Huh? You gonna go outside and wait for Domino? Where's Domino? Where's Millie Vanilli? <clears throat> yeah, Elvis said he was with her. So you're gonna have to bear that through life, honey. <laughs> I'll tell you, your life will never be the same again. I'm on the bottom of YouTube. You're one of uh you're one of the king's conquests there. You ain't nothing but a hound dog. Hmm? <laughs> Oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know if that's the real Dave Dickey. Yeah, you'll see the taint. My lips are turning green. There we go. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> George, are you okay? Are you hobblecocked? Huh? What's up, Papa? Are you hobblecocked? What's up, Mama? Huh? Are you hobblecocked? Hmm? Oh, he was limping bad last night on that lake. Seems that okay lake. tonight. It's Today, always I it's think. always in the evening. Uh, He's got that. Yeah, is he at your Give place, him Kelly? Him. Or are you gonna you gonna put him up down there at the uh, at the trailer park, the RV park down there? Yeah, wear your green lipstick tonight. That's right. You got the taint. <clears throat> That's going to be awesome sauce. That's going to be awesome. Green lipstick. In the honor of the Irish. <laughs> well, JK, I'm not going to give a comment to that. I'm not going <laughs> to, you know, I just can't even comment on that. <clears throat> I can't even comment on that. Can't even comment on that. All right, guys. Well, I think that's been, uh, I think yeah. it's been about an hour or We've so. I want to thank to everybody. Do, grass to mow and weeds to pull and lots of yard work to do. Let's do some good, honest work. Debbie Lynn, love you, honey. JK Nokia, I love you. Vegas Vixen, Graham Townsend, nice to see you, my friend. Each and every one of you <laughs> rock. Thank you for being here. Hugs, love, and kisses. Have a good one, everybody. Mm -hmm.